Hey, good morning, everyone. This is uh, Gabe Roberts from Back to Nature Lifestyle Medicine. I'm um, just giving you a couple of updates of some things that have gone on in the office lately. Um, I have officially dropped the title of doctor. I um, don't go by doctor anymore at all. I have uh, all new people, new clients, um, prospective clients, patients. They all can't call me Gabe. And uh, this is the way I prefer it. I've actually uh, removed all the plaques from my wall. Okay, we'll just take a quick peek up here. My wall's kind of bare. There's the placards laying over here in the corner. And uh, it, it, placards and certifications and uh, things like that are, are not really important when it comes to the patient and the patient's health. Um, I had a recent uh, new patient come in and uh, she was asking me what best was, and I was telling her, um, I'm a best practitioner, I'm the only one in Johnson County, but that shouldn't matter, because ultimately, it's the client's responsibility. It's, it's their health is in their own hands, okay, period. Um, disease occurs in people, because one of two areas, one of two areas and that comes down to cell signaling and cell function cell signaling and cell function and cell function is pretty easy to um, that's the easy part that's the easy part of care function comes down to how well the cell is functioning and if we're gonna if we're ultimately going to give people their life back and and get them through these uh, burdens and these difficult situations they're in um, we can't look at them macroscopic. We have to look at the cell, okay? And cell function can be influenced by nutrition. It can be influenced by removing infectious burdens, you know, stealth infections, that kind of thing. But the more important part is, is the signaling. And the signaling comes down to what message are you sending your body every day? When you walk into a grocery store, and you see a random stranger and they, they smile at you, and it's a genuine smile, and you smile back, it feels nice, okay? That's the signaling I'm talking about. When you are around people who appreciate you, who actually love you and actually care about you and make you feel good, that's the signaling, okay? If you have toxic family members, toxic friends, or a toxic spouse, your signaling is not going to be optimal. And from a health perspective, you're at a disadvantage. Signaling, signaling directs function. And you have to work on the signaling. And this takes a little time. It's important to recognize this and every day do little steps to, to ensure that you're getting the right signaling, to ensure you're, you're feeling good, that feeling of accomplishment, that feeling of purpose. If you live a life that has purpose in it, Okay. You can live the equivalent of 50 lifetimes. Okay. If you wake up in the morning and you, and you dread getting out of your bed and you're going to a job you hate, um, those kind of things are f signaling. And you're, you're fooling yourself if you think that you can reach optimal health and optimal function when the signaling is malfunctioned. Okay. So just a little bit of tidbits there. I don't go by a doctor anymore. Um, because it's not my responsibility to heal the person, okay? We can give them better guidance than anywhere else, okay? We have referrals from all over the United States. We have patients come in that have been to Mayo Clinic three times. Um, I see a number of patients who have been to other functional medicine doctors, and they come in with uh, very expensive tabs and synthetic supplements, and they still have infections, and I often wonder, what did this gentleman do for you? Because you're, you're just as much of a mess as you were before you started his care or her care, okay? So it's ultimately the client's responsibility, but we can use the right testing when it's appropriate, um, using the right procedures when they're appropriate, and ultimately figure out why, why your body's not responding, okay? But you have to walk down the path we can give you better guidance. We can give you better tools for helping the signaling and helping the function um, than, than 
most practitioners offer. But every patient determines their own outcome, and that's just the way it is. Okay? So, um, for now, I'll say goodbye. Uh, I hope you have a great day. Stay hydrated. Stay, um, keep your salts up. You know, you don't want to go out and sweat everything out and lose your salts. So, keep your, your Celtic salt handy. Add a little pinch to your water. Hopefully, it's not tap water. And until then, um, love yourself, love each other, and have a great day. Thank you.